Hi, my lovelies. Oh, let me just sit there. Right. Are you in shot? I think so. Right. I thought I'd just film. I'm going to have a go and making some um, cover minders. Because I did the two um, little beaded ones. So now I thought I'm going to have a go at some metal ones. Because I saw Mrs. Coffee with some. So I thought I'll have a go. So I've got two tubs of metal bits and pieces, which I'll show you in a minute. But these are the batteries I've got. There's 60 in there and they're 10 millimetre by 2 millimetre, mini strong ones, they say. And I ordered them on Monday. They were supposed to come this Thursday, but they came yesterday. So from Amazon. They weren't prime. And I can't get into the box. That's it. But they came came yesterday, so I was dead dead chuffed. So that's them. They seem to be quite. Oh, oh dear! Uh, uh, I don't want them all. Whoops! I put them in there. So that's um ten millimeters across and ten millimeters thick, and then I've got some. E6000, which is supposed to be flexible, waterproof, non flammable, self leveling form formula, transparent, clear, industrial strength, adhesive. Well, it's supposed to do metal to metal. If you use, I have tried not with these, but when I was doing something with Jesse, metal to metal with the glue gun, and it fell apart. So these are my little pots of bits and pieces that I've collected. I've got silver ones. I don't think there's anything really in here. Maybe a Christmas tree for Christmas. Ooh. Can you see that one? I don't think I've got anything. Anything worth doing in there. So I'll put that to the side. I've got this one. This is the one that I want to do. Hee <laughs> hee, look at that. I think that cost me 25p or something. It was for a necklace. It's got a hole in the top. I've got some nice metal flowers that you can put beads in. If you wanted a ginormous one, I could use a cross. These are bits of earrings that I've picked up and I've just chopped up. Same as them. Or earrings. That was a necklace. Look at that. Oh, look at that. I might have a try on that one. Isn't that, isn't that lovely? Just usually mostly necklace pieces that I just pick up. Let's dig in there. And then I've got some of those box top things, the cabbage ones, if I wanted to make some. Oh, look what I've done. <laughs> and then I've got some. Let's put the lid on there a minute. And I've got some in here as well. So let's have a look. I did have a pile of cobs. Oh, look at my little owl. I think the most I pay for these is like 25p or something like that each. There's another nice flower. Which would make a nice, nice one as well. A key. Should we try a key one? Do a key one, couldn't we? We can get into it. So this will either work absolutely brilliant, or it will be a load of. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. We got some butterflies, but they need a little gem or something in there. Oh, that's one that I put something in. I don't know why I put that one on there. It must have been for something. A little, a little, little bitty leaf. I don't know if I want that. Oh, that was a brooch. So if I wanted to use that, which I might do, i just got to zip the thing off to the back with a pair of uh, what we do. We might, we might alter that one, actually. I'll, I'll just stop it and go and find a pair of pliers to rip the back off. What do you say? I do have some nice butterflies, some thick butterflies. 
I don't know. Oh, there's one, but it's got no, that's the same as the other one I just showed you. Oh, penny, penny farthing. Right, let me just stop it and I'll go and see if I can find the, the... Right, I found some bits. Now, that's a ring. These are all bits that I got from car boot sales. All right, this is a ring. The most it cost me was 50p and that was that one. The rest are like 10p or 20p. That's a ring. I'm going to see if we can get the back off. I'm not sure. Sometimes they come off some later. That's a... Look, one of those um, earrings. I think that's quite cute. Of the sun. Oh, hang on. Oh, sorry. Just knocked it. Don't focus. I ain't got my glasses on, so I can't see a blinking thing. A bit stilly, aren't I? Right, can you see that? That's the sun. That's a hair. Hair grip. I think that was 20p. That one's a plasticky sort of metal brooch. That's a 10p earring. I've used the other one on something. 10p earring. I think that was a 50p brooch. So you can pick them up. So easy peasy, lemon squeezy. So, right, shall we have a go? Shall we? Shall we have a go? Let's have a go. If it don't work, then we won't upload, will we? And there's probably easier ways of doing it, but do we care? Yeah. And there's probably an easier way of getting in this blinking bag. There's the cold over there, it is. Right. Let's have a go here. Yeah. So we're going to try and see if I can rip this off. Can you see what I'm doing? Just getting the pliers in to that bit of metal and it's pulled it off. So we're left with that and I don't think that's going to come off. But I'm not bothered because we'll try and put the... Oop. And get into it again. Oh, should have left it open, shouldn't I? That's it. I keep trying to do it from the side instead of the top. Right. So we need to stick that. It's not metal, look. I don't know what it is, but it's not sticking. So we're going to stick, try and stick the old doodah. This one. That's thing on the top and fair play you want to be in a ventilated area with this stuff because boy oh boy oh boy does it smell right so that's all I've done is stuck that magnum on there pressed it down so the glue was filled in the void at the back and it's not come through the front lock so I'll put that one up there right what next one should we do should we do this one Shall we? Because that's the one that I wanted done originally. So again, just put a blob of glue on there. And stick it in the middle. Put it up to dry. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, does that stuff whiffed. <laughs> right, so we see. I don't know if I've got the strength to get this one off. Oh, look at that. One pull and it came off. But I don't know whether I want to use this one or not. It's got diamond missing there. But if I did decide on this one, then again, separate these. You could, oops, a daisy. Just fill that void with something. And then stick that on there, can you see? But make sure you cover that hole else the glue will seep through there. But you can stick like a little little square blob in the middle and then stick that on top of that so it sticks up. I might save that one for another day because I want to repair that one because it's got a gem missing there. I'm not going to, I won't use this one, but you could 
in principle take that off and do the same but I've got something else I've got a flower piece that I want to put that on should we try this one let's right, see if this comes off as easy as the others that come off so grab it oh, bet you this one will be a bugger ah see my strength I get rid of the metal I hope you can see all this okay get the old glue blob some on just a blob like that look press it on leave it to dry so we've got three down that's a bit big should we do this big flower now you could if you wanted to fill these little things with little gems if you wanted it to be a bit more sparkly if you've got little tiny gems or little seed beads even and just pop them in there or um, another thing is if you've got if the kids have got it glitter glue and put a little drop of glitter glue in there just to shine them up but you can do that at a later date anyway so let's get some more let's get some more Whoa. Ooh, a bit much come out there. Oh, per day, you see, it's all coming out now. Oh, I got it everywhere. Got it everywhere. Doesn't matter. Hang on. Have I got a cloth? Oh, he's... Oh, that's one of Jesse's. Hang on. Let me just stick that one there. We've got that one. Rub my fingers together to get that one off. Should we do the key? Might as well while we're at it. Plonk it on. So we've got one, two, three, four, five. I'll show you this one. I'll just I'll take them apart ready because if I don't use them on here, I'll be using so literally put your pliers and I got so I've either used that one and I've used that whatever you've got same with this one there's not many I've had that you can't take it apart and if I can't do it usually Grant can oh, I might need the other ones for that one there we go and that one. So we've got them at a later date if we want to do them. These ones, similar to the other flower, you can put a little gem in the middle of there and some little gems around the side if you want to. Again, just put your magnum on. Magnum. I think I'm having a blinking ice cream, don't I? I dropped that on the floor now. Magnet, even. Magnet. Not a magnum, Caroline. A magnet. Nut. Right. So we're going to have to do that one, aren't we? Going to have to do that one. Right, so I want one more. Right. Oh, hang on. We've got no right mess here. So I'm going to leave them dry and we'll come back once they're dry. Right, I let them set for a little while, so we'll see. Can you see all right? I don't know. Right, these are um, two that I made the other day, but I only had... Um, oh, that one's one of the new ones I've got, but I put with it. But I only had these tiny ones compared to the new ones that come. Can you see the difference? So they're the two that I made the other day. This is what I thought about these. So that one seems okay. Yeah, so. I think they're set. That one feels maybe a little bit, maybe I didn't put enough glue under it. So right, so there's the other ones. So should we get our diamond painting in 
because this is the one I'm working on at the moment. So shall we try it out? Right, it's either going to work or it's going to be an epic fail. So we'll put one on there. Oh, I'll put it further up. There you go. Oh, can you see it? Oh, my God, you can't see, can you? Can you see it? On the back. And that one's worked. Should we try another one? Try the, the bigger one. Where is it? I got the right way round. Hang on. There it goes. Hang on. I'll do this one up. Put it under there. Have I got it the right way up? Oh yes. Oh yeah, so we got that one. What else have we got? These two left. Oh, that feels like no. There you go. The key. That was caught. That one. One more, should we try it over there? Oh, that one's not so. Is on Why is that going off to the side? I don't, know. I don't know if I like that one or not. But you live in there, so hang on. Right, so if I shake this, can you see shake it? it is, they are not going anywhere. I wonder why that. Oh, <laughs> I had it the wrong way round. That's better luck. Can you see that? Even picking them up by them. And then we have these ones that I made. There you go. So even them ones. So shall I zoom you in a bit closer so you can see them? So that's, oh sorry. Sorry, we've got a light up above that's glaring on, on the on the plastic. So we've got that one now. The winged one. Wingy Wongs. We've got that one. The key. The flower, which I think I might put some gems or something in there just to spruce it up. We've got the steampunk clock. That was the brooch. Flower, daisy flower. And then that one. So there you are. So I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight now that I've made myself. So any, if I can do it, anybody can do it. So I hope you like my little tutorial. Tutorial. And yeah, look at that. So I can swap and change them now. If I'm on a big one, you've got big ones. If I want little ones, I've got little ones. Listen to that. You can hear them. Can you hear it? it's clicking together so yes yeah, so thanks for stopping by and uh, if you like what you saw and you want to see more from me and you're not subscribed press the subscribe button or just press the bell and that will tell you when I put videos up or when I go live and you can join in and uh, yeah if you want to leave a comment down below feel free and give it a thumbs up as well it would be absolutely superb but it's up to you I just appreciate you calling by. So look after yourselves, take care and speak to you all soon. Bye for now.